got a brand new challenge. This bitch called the Snatch a Rapper Purse. Snatch a Rapper Purse Challenge. Any rapper you catch, this all 2020, all 2020. Any rapper you catch with a motherfucking purse, snatch that bitch. You know, we back on that snatch of purses, but we not taking old lady purses. If you take an old lady purse, you a bitch. If you take a girl purse, you a bitch. But you know, on the other side, if you take a rapper purse, you could get a verse from Lil Wap. You catch any rapper with the biggest Chanel bag in the store that they want, go snatch that shit. You know, any rapper with the with the with the big with the slash half purse, any kind of purse, you send with that bitch, snatch that bitch. By Lil Wap Hussein signed off, I'ma give y'all a verse. I swear to God, whoever win the challenge, y'all getting verses. All right, Baton Rouge rapper. I hopefully, hopefully, I'm pronouncing his name right. Tech is uh, coming for Young Thug and Gunner, and basically they wear purses. And he said he's he's starting to snatch a rapper purse challenge. Any uh, rapper purse you snatch, and you know the, the little you know they got the little Nike bag to go around the chest, and people don't think that's a purse or the fanny pack. He clarified that those are purses. Biggest Chanel bag. You snatch it, you get a verse from him. And um, the reason why he mad is because it's rumored that um, Young Thug started a clothing line named Spider, and his record label name is Spider Nation, so he continued to go in on both Gunner and Young Thug. Let's talk a little bit about it. We back, Goodfellas Sports TV. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, bell icon button, share the video. And, yeah, man, for him, you know, when somebody bite off your style, I can relate. You know what I'm saying? You don't like that, man. You know, kind of, kind of snake, snake you, whatever. But you know, he did what he posed to do. I listened to a little bit of his music. He's straight. He's straight. You know, I understand what he's saying. He pronunciating and stuff. He ain't like Young Thug and him. I don't listen to neither one of them. But um, and I felt that Gunner messed up uh that Polo G song. I think he was on that. But at the end of the day, um, it all it you know it started off the uh they said it started off him Young Thug. You know, stealing his uh his name Spider, and turned into a clothing line, and he, he ain't like that. And I I don't know if he tried to get at him, you know, on the phone and hop on the horn. He went straight to social media. Most time, young, old, and in between, they go straight to social media to address a problem. They won't go straight to the plug. All right, I, I ain't condoning these brothers, you know, you know, going at each other. But what you know, he took it before all that. He took it a step further, and I wasn't gonna talk about it until he did the snatch a rapper purse challenge. But basically, um, he put a video. He 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 did a T.I. to Gunner. He put a video of Gunner being on Crime Stoppers or First Forty Eight, whatever it was. And you know, basically, he said that his cousin didn't commit a murder. This guy committed a murder. And Tech went out there and said that he snitching. He snitching. Y'all condoning rats. Gunner rat. And a lot of people in the comment section said that it don't change the way they look at Gunner because I guess Gunner music ain't gangster. You know what I'm saying? But he went out there to say he a rat. And also, he threatened not only Young Thug and Gunner, but he threatened their children. That's how mad he was. He threatened to take their children out the game. No OT. All right? <laughs> so I think he went a little bit too far, you know, making threats. You can't do that on social media, man. And since then, he took that video down. You can't be making threats on social media. Just be about it, you know, because something do happen to them, and you ain't do it. You're going to be somebody that that's a uh, him part of the investigation. Stop I mean, these young dudes, man, that's my word of advice to him, man. He seemed like a cool dude, man, most of his rap. My thing to him is don't don't talk about it, be about it. You know what I'm saying? You know, if that's what you want to do, you want to get gangster, don't go to social media, don't tell a lot of people, just make the move and do what you got to do. You know what I'm saying? But they should have hopped on the horn. I don't know if he tried to hop on the horn. He gave him the play around. He gave him the 2-3 zone. He gave him the run around like, nah, man, it ain't even like that, dog. And or he didn't pick up the phone at all, but uh little homie mad. You know what I'm saying? And y'all see he got the spider chain on right there. And like he said, he exposed Gunner for being a rat. I mean, people, and you got some people that say, Yo, I'm tired of y'all condoning rats and all this. But at the end of the day, they hanging around rats. They're a rat they self. You know what I'm saying? You go back and they listen to a bunch of rappers that rat it. But like I said before, you know, he pulled up the old receipts and then you know, he started the Snatcher Rapper Purse uh, Challenge, man. Get a verse from him. I like that challenge, dog. You know what I'm saying? And and what's going? And this is what happened. And this is a little game right here. This is what happened when the father's not in the house or the father, 
can't be in the house. I was talking to a dude out of the gym, right? He works at the gym I, I go to. And I was talking. I was like, yeah, these dudes got these purses. I don't even know how we got onto it. He's like, yeah, my wife, man. Be like, leave him alone. But I'll be telling them the little Nas X song that was that was homosexual and the purses they wear. But they don't want to listen. And it is. A lot of people don't know they going down a bisexual, homosexual route. You know, just by, you know, the boondocks explaining. They got them little Nike things over there. That's, that's, come on, man. We don't, the real men don't wear no purses. You know what I'm saying? All that shit around your neck and around, and, and, and the purses you can't, all them is purses. The fanny packs. The one to go across your chest. You ain't Indiana Jones. It's a purse. So I ain't mad at that, man. You know what I'm saying? I really ain't mad. But what's what happen when you let the women, you know, the kids listen to the women. You know what I'm saying? And women raise men. That's why men got to be a strong, integral part of their household. They got to be the head of the household. You know what I'm saying? Because if you really got a strong man that's the head of your household, that won't happen. You ain't wearing no purses. You ain't wearing no satchel. You ain't wearing no fanny packs. You know what I'm saying? You ain't wearing no Chanel bags. That won't happen. But that's part our fault for a lot of men bailing on their kids and bailing on situations with women. Matter of fact, busting in women and making them baby mothers. You know, you don't want to be with them. You know what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, that's a product of, you know, you know, females raising men, you know, and, and that's messed up, man. But yeah, them dudes hella fruity in the booty, dog. <laughs> Gunner gun, and Young Thug, bro. You know what I'm saying? All these purses, Young Thug, for sure. People swear he ain't gay. Come on, man. They take up for him, man, and then turn around and blast another rapper like Lil Nas X. But your rapper, your favorite rapper, your thug, he is. Or whatever you want to say, bisexual. He got kids. That ain't nothing new. But shout out to Tech, man, for starting, uh, starting the Snatch Your Purse Challenge, bro. I had to do a video on that, man. Shout out to that dude, man. He got a new fan in me, dog. But hey, let me know what you guys think about it, man. It was the funniest thing I heard all yesterday, man. So salute to him, man. My advice to him is... At the end of the day, handle it how you gonna handle it, but don't never don't let them tell you, don't let them don't never tell them your first move, brother. But hey, don't forget we on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. Reach out to the email if you got business questions, inquiries, sponsorship, video requests. Keep sharing the videos. Hit that subscribe button, bell icon button. Let me know what you guys think. Want to make a donation? That link subscription, but just share the video and um check our music entertainment playlist for more videos like this. One time for the one time we gone.